and gentlemen, let's give him another great big welcome for Jeremiah and Laurie, number one hot couple in St. Louis.
Okay, welcome back to the program. I'm with Jeremiah and Lori Maleg. They were our polka dancing with the stars celebrities of the evening at the Polish Falcons picnic tonight. Welcome to St. Louis. Yes, thank, thank you. you. And you came all the way from? Up by Shawano, Wisconsin. Shauna, Wisconsin. They were a special guest of Anthony Kaminsky, and they put on a great performance, which you are going to see on tape. Um, how long have you two been dancing together? Eleven years. And you started out uh, where? Uh, I started dancing in uh, Wisconsin, um, probably when I was in fifth or sixth grade. And uh, Lori, uh, go ahead. I grew up in Michigan, and so I learned from my family, and then that's where we met in Frankenmuth, Michigan at the Summer Music Festival 11 years ago. Very cool. And Lori is our special celebrity on TV Krakowia because she is Polish, and your name is? My maiden name is um, Wisniewski, or Wisniewski. So. And your parents both Polish? Um, my mom is half and half, so uh, my grandma was um, German, my grandpa was Polish, and then my dad was all Polish. And do you know about your heritage, like where they came from in Poland? Or Not exactly, no. no. Okay. No. All right. Well, um, what's your favorite Polish dance to do? Favorite Polish dance? Um, I don't think we have anything specific. Um, we just dance to our favorite bands and uh, just do our own style, the new and hot. Um, moves that we've learned as we've grown up. So there isn't anything specific that the typical Polish people are used to uh, of that specific dance that you're probably looking for an answer for. And well, that's why that's why Anthony brought us down here, was to show these younger people the capabilities of what they have the potential of doing as they continue to grow up. And that it's not just maybe a specific dance style tradition. or to the traditions that people are used to. Mm -hmm. And um, so we're trying to help that grow throughout this country, not just here, and but but everywhere. And so, as we continue to get invited around the country, we're going to continue to do the same thing and just keep tearing it up. So we saw you do the polka and the I don't know how to say the obaric. Ob obaric. Mm -hmm. Do you prefer either one of those? Um, I like the obaric. Um, Probably just because it allows us to really connect uh, closer. We like dancing a good Pol uh, Polish polka beat, but uh, I don't know, when we get to the Oberics or the Waltzes, um, I don't know, it just seems to bring us both closer together, and I think we're both smiling more than <laughs> when we're dancing the, the other style. But. Um, we just have fun doing it. Okay, because we have a Metro Polka Club here in St. Louis and Illinois, and they like a combination of the dances, so that's why we are asking. And then do you try to put your own little twist on the dances or something, a little modern kick to it? Definitely. Um, he flips me, actually. So, yeah, that, it kind of throws people off. You know, randomly we'll do a flip in there. Um, but, yeah, you know, getting a little wiggles and some twisting and different things going on like that. He's got some crazy footwork, crazy footwork. I could not even think of doing that but and is that your own choreography oh yes definitely <laughs> uh, it's just something that kind of came naturally out of my entire family that dances I'm probably the one that really took off with it and went all over the country going to all the dances and I just strive to continue <laughs> to be better and better at it and any move that I saw when I first started getting into the industry uh, I had to learn it if I you know I would ask that particular individual hey how did you do that move if I couldn't figure it out I wanted to know how to do it and then there was just a lot of things that I just just instituted in on my own that I've never seen. It just made sense to do it to the beat and it fit right, so I did it. And then having a great partner like Lori uh, allowed both of us to be able to do our moves uh, to the most extreme. Do you get to contribute to the choreography? Um, I don't think I'm as creative. I just kind of follow. So that's kind of the one nice thing. I actually never thought I'd be able to find a guy that could polka dance because I grew up that way. So I'm like, you know, this is going to be really hard. You know, a lot of the guys that go out there and dance, they're dancing like chickens. <laughs> so I saw him and I'm like, wow, he's hot and he can dance. So I just I just follow. All right. Just follow. Oh, and we, we're lacking young Polish men that can polka. So um, I hope you can do everything that you can to contribute. Keep coming back. Yes. Uh, put on performances and uh, we appreciate you being here and can you say good night to all our TV Krakowia people Dobra Dobranoc. Dobra Dobra good night <laughs> good night <laughs>